Okay, boys and girls, this is our review for our quiz. So a few things that we need to know is that um, all the structures that are inside of a cell, regardless if it's a plant cell or a, uh, an animal cell, are called organelles. And the organelles are like, as we talked about in class, like organs. Inside of us, we have organs. Inside of a plant cell or an animal cell, we have organelles. So there's a whole bunch of different organelles. Uh, one of the things that we need to know is that there's the jelly-like substance inside of the plant cell or animal cell is the cytoplasm. And the cytoplasm is helps suspend all of the different organelles within, suspend them um, within the uh, uh, cell itself. So cytoplasm is like a jelly-like substance inside the cell. The mitochondria or mitochondrion right here is the power house. And if you remember in class, we talked about how it's mighty. So it's like power. So it's the powerhouse. The mitochondria gives the energy, which is ATP it's called, but it's the energy to the cell. So it gives the cell energy. There's a, every cell, including a plant cell, has a thin covering on, on it, and that thin covering is, and it's right here, it's kind of hard to see, but is the cell membrane. So it's a cell membrane. Try to write it in there. So cell membranes um, lets uh, different uh, chemicals pass inside and out, out of the cells from the plant cell, and animal cells also have them too. So it's the cell membrane. Uh, what, what else do we need to know? Um, we need to know the nucleus. The nucleus is the brains of the cell. So the nucleus uh, controls all the activities of the cell. We also have right here, you know, the vacuole. And the vacuole is very important to a plant cell. It gets larger when the plant has lots of moisture. Uh, it also gets larger because it contains waste and food in there. So the vacuole can get really big. Also, what the vacuum does, it, it gets it when it gets real big, it it helps keep the plant rigid or firm. If the vacuum is close to empty, then we know that the plant will wilt. Something else you need to know is the chloroplast, and the chloroplast contain chlorophyll, and the chloroplast it makes uh, the food for the plant. So it's through photosynthesis, chloroplast creates glucose and makes glucose. Um, the chlorophyll inside of the chloroplast helps make, is what makes the plant green. Okay, you'll also need to know that the plant cell, unlike an animal cell, has a cell wall. And the cell wall is a firm covering around the entire cell. Uh, what the cell wall does, it helps make the cell rigid like a soldier, stands up like a soldier, and helps the plant stand up also. So cell wall, um, you'll need to know. And make sure you remember that a cell wall and also the chloroplasts are only in plant cells. They are not located in animals. We also need to know that the basic unit of structure and function of a living thing, you should know that that's a cell. So a cell is the basic unit of structure. Um, and I think that's pretty much it. So just if you watch the video a couple times and just look through your notes, I think you guys are going to be.